morning friends and I am gonna start off my new year at Target so that is where I am at this morning I thought I'd run into Target I have seen a lot of pictures on Instagram regarding the dollar spot and I'm like oh my gosh I really need to go check out the dollar spot and there was an item in here that I'm hoping that is in here that I want to get for my dining room table just for a centerpiece something new something different and yeah I thought I would take you guys along so I'm hoping that Target is not like stupid crowded where I can't share anything so I'm going to do my best and take you guys along and I thought I'd run into Kirkland's I might run into TJ Maxx because it's here as well so let's go enjoy our morning and let's go check out a few things and then I'll share with you guys what I pick up once I get home all right I'm in TJ Maxx now and I don't see anything but these are super cute how cute are those I like those with a little sugar but it looks like the they're like fading off but how cute are those though? I like those. Those would be cute in like a tiered tray. I don't see any Ray Dunn stuff. No Ray Dunn. They do have some clearance stuff here at TJ Maxx, but nothing that catches my eye. These cards are really cute for $2. Holiday cards. Those are cute. Those are nice. Are they all the same? Yeah, they are. That'd be cute for next year to send out Christmas cards for next year. These are cute too for like a Christmas gift. They're glasses. Cute. Those are on sale for $5 and you get six of them. That's really cute. More cards over there. Ooh, let's go look at those ones. Okay, here's more cards. So these ones are Ray Dunn cards. Those are cute. Those are $3. Okay, I think I'll get these. And there is how many of them in here? Oh, it's a note card set. You get 12 note cards, 13 envelopes, 12 stickers. That's cute. So I get both of those. Those are cute and they're right done. <gasps> cute. Any more? No. I don't see any more. But this jar is cute for Christmas. Six dollars for that. Cute. This is cute too. Oh, actually, no, it's not. Cute. This is a tea set, like an advent calendar tea set. Ten dollars for that one. There's another one. That's cute. Another advent calendar. Ten dollars for that one. Oh, that it's all teas. Nice. Cute, cute. That's a cute card. Cute, cute. Alrighty guys, so I'm back from Target, TJ Maxx, and Kirkland's. I went into Michael's as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys some of the stuff that I picked up while I was there. I did not have an opportunity while I was in Target to film anything or in Kirkland's or in Michael's, but I think I did a little bit in TJ Maxx because all those other places were kind of packed. I did not go into the back of Target where they had all the Christmas or seasonal stuff to check out any new Valentine stuff. It's just I had kind of like made a glimpse back there and uh, there was like all the shelves were down. There was a bunch of people back there. They were trying to rearrange things. So I just avoided that area altogether. But anyway, these are the few things. My nose is itching, sorry. A few of the things that I did pick up while it was there. We'll start off with Target. These were at the Target dollar spot. These were a dollar. There's like little succulents. And they already had them like in the jars. So I picked up four of those. Super cute. I picked up this. It's almost like a gray and dark navy blue. It just says welcome to our home. Absolutely love this. I thought I could stick like a plant in there. That'd be cute. And then these little like cloth napkins just for decoration, which are super cute as well. These were $3 at the dark, at the dark. $3 at the dollar spot. And then that one was $3 as well. And then I went over to the um, hearth and hand area. This candle is amazing. It was a little bit pricey at $15, but it's just so pretty and it smells fantastic. Um, I picked up this cute little thing. It's separate. Um, <clears throat> this little plant was like, I think it was 
$2.99, $3.99, yeah, $2.99. And then this little wooden thing, it was cute. This was $6.99 and they had these like right next to each other. So you just kind of like put it in there. So that's kind of what it looks like. So that's cute. So I picked that up and then I picked up this cute little thing, which I'm going to sit in my kitchen. I love this tray. It was $9.99. This again was part of the Hearth and Hand collection. Love that. And then I picked up some Slim Jims because I love eating these for just like a little snack. And I picked up some paper plates because that's our fine china. Um, the other things that I picked up at Target was cute little outfits for my nephew who's going to be born this month. So this one was on sale for $7.98. I just thought it was really cute. Little sleeper. And then um, it also came with a little, this t-shirt. So it's just a cute little outfit. Super cute. Then I picked up this cute little jammies, which I'm not sure if I already got one with the dinosaurs. If I did, oh well, he'll have two. This was on sale for $4.48. And then for my niece's baby, which is going to be my great niece, I picked this up. This was $4.18. This is just a cute little dress. And I figured she's going to be born in April. And this is a three to six months, so she could probably wear this, you know, um, April, May, June-ish. So this is cute. And then I got this cute little dress. This is navy blue with like little black polka dots. Super darn cute. This is, uh, this was uh, $8.48. So I just thought this was cute. It's got little boomers in there. Love all that stuff. So I'll be taking that to them. Uh, when I go at sometime this month to my mom and dad's. So at TJ Maxx, I also picked this up for my brother's baby. Um, this was four fifty, so it's just a little sleeper with little foxes on it. So I'll add that to his little baby collection. Super cute. And then I got this cute little mouse. Isn't she like the cutest little mouse? She's like a little Valentine's mouse. She was cute. Loved her. So I'm gonna sit her out in my house somewhere for Valentine's. Um, I did pick these up. <clears throat> I did show you. You guys these in my little vlog while I was there I was the only thing I was concerned about is that the color like I just need to color those in because those seem to be coming off like fading away but I thought these were just really cute and I think I could just sit these like in my tiered uh, three-tiered tray or whatever on my counter so I like these these are super cute and then um then I got this blanket which was over in the baby section I think it was like 20 nine dollars regular thirty dollars and it was fifteen dollars today so i just thought this was cute i can actually sit this on my bed because it's like a light pink with some gold in there it was so pretty and then i picked up these little um oven mitts mini mitts they're cute um and they're mickey mouse super cute these are 5.99 at tj maxx i needed new mitts anyway because mine were like wearing through and then i picked up this one because it's a valentine's mitt super cute love that one and then I picked up this cute little planter to sit inside of my uh, three-tiered tray as well. And this was, I think, $6.99. Uh, yeah, $6.99. I always love getting those little fake plants everywhere. And then um, this is another thing I picked up at TJ Maxx. These um, Ray Dunn holiday Christmas cards. Super cute. I'll put these away for next year. And then, let's see, um, I picked, oh, then I went to Kirkland's, and the other thing that I had bought at Kirkland's is already hanging up on my wall, so I'll show you guys that when I leave this room. But I picked these up, because I'm going to go ahead and put these inside of a little um, container that I have in the living room. I picked up some yogurt pretzels while I was at TJ Maxx as well, because these are super good, and I love eating those. And at Michael's, these are the cutest, little, tiniest, little mason jar things. These are so cute. These were $4.00. So I picked up two of these and they are glass. And then I picked this up because this is what I'm gonna start putting in my room right here. And this was um, regular $100 and I got it for 50. So this is just one of those drawer sets that I'm gonna probably set over here by my desk area. I'm gonna sell this, get rid of it. So I'm gonna kind of start gathering all of my stuff. And I, I actually have to put that together myself, which I'm not happy about, but whatever. Uh, I mean, Brian would put it together for me if I asked him to, but I would probably just prefer to put it together because it'll sit there forever. And then I have to, oh, sorry. And then I would have to listen to it because he gets like, rawr, 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 rawr. this thing's never go together right. Rawr, rawr, rawr. The directions are wrong. Rawr, rawr, rawr. So I'll just put it together myself. So that's what I'm going to do. All right. So now I'm going to show you guys what else I bought at Kirkland's and I'm going to hang it. I already hung it up 
And then um, I'm gonna go ahead and put this stuff away. Alrighty, so I actually had a window here on this wall, and this is where I put that new thing that I got at Kirkland's. And I actually put the window, I had like replaced, let me start over. The window I normally have on my fireplace, which you guys can see that right over there. That's the one that I always have on my fireplace. I switched that off. I mean, I switched the wreath on it like every season. Okay, well, I took it down for Christmas this year for decoration because I had something else up. Well, I put that window over here on this wall. And because I did that, I took the, win the window back off and put it back over in the mantle after the, the Christmas season was over so I could put it back. This is what I bought to put on this wall in place of the mirror, which are the window, because it is actually perfect. And it actually came with the wreath and everything. It was on sale for $60 at Kirkland's. So I went ahead and got it because I knew that this would just be a perfect spot for it to fit on this wall. So it's what you see when you walk down the hallway. Like the first thing that you see when you walk down the hallway, um, minus my dusting cloth and stuff there <laughs> and my totes that are in the hallway. But anyway, that's the first thing like you'll see when you walk down. But anyway, so that's where I put that, which I'm happy about. And then those little balls and stuff that I bought, I put those right down there because that's exactly where I wanted them to go. And then let me take you guys in here in the kitchen and let me show you guys what I did with lights. Um, what I did with that little plant, that little pl um, tin thing. So I put that up here on the shelf. I'm still kind of rearranging the shelf. I don't know if I want to just like, you know, take one of those down and only have two of those there, which is just super cute anyway. And then I'm just going to move this over and just kind of have that there and then move that over. That's another thing that I got at Target today. So I kind of like, this is kind of cute and I'm okay with how it looks right now. So yeah, 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 kind of cute. And then I did put this little plant right here at the top of my three tiered tray. And then that little mason jar thing I added right there just for now. And then the other one I haven't, obviously you guys can tell I'm still kind of going through things here. So not everything is perfect or in its spot. So I'm just kind of throwing things together for this right now. So that's not done or near done yet <laughs> so and then i also want to show you guys a few of the things that i was actually getting done this week as this weekend as well uh cleaning off the table is a goal because i still have some stuff sitting here on the table that i need to go through um that is going to be like my centerpiece and basically i want to not do that as my centerpiece right now i am looking for which target did not have is i'm looking for one of those they say metal or galvanized tin, I'm not really sure, but it's it's a lantern, but it's shaped like a house. And it's kind of, I think it's got sides and you could put like a candle inside of it. So I'm looking for one of those. And I went to Target today, they did not have it. I went to Target.com, they're sold out. And I looked on Amazon, can't find them there. So yeah, that's what I'm kind of looking for. I have an idea in my head of what I want to do here. Um, so when I find one, I will, um, get one. But for now, that's, um, that's, that's that. I put that there for Valentine's. Uh, yeah. So that's kind of what I'm doing, but I got to, you know, work on my table here a little bit and get that back to norm. And then today for dinner, I'm making two different meals, lights again, sorry. Uh, Brian wanted some chicken soup. So I'm making chicken soup for him. I need to take that chicken out and shred it. And then for myself, I am making that uh, green bean and chicken with cream of mushroom soup and, oops, sorry, cream of mushroom soup. And I need to take the chicken out and shred it as well. But I just love this stuff. It is really, really good, but it cooks up so quickly. Um, but I need to just put the lid on it so it doesn't dry out. So. But yeah, I only put one can of green beans in it this time and one can of cream of mushroom soup. So I'm not sure if I'm going to go ahead and need those two or not. So I'm just going to leave it there. But I do keep adding some chicken broth to it so it's not so like dry and pasty. And then I did um, kind of work on some stuff around here this past weekend. I actually tucked my light up underneath here um and the cord and everything but it looks like i need to do it again because it looks like it fell from this angle from this part see it keeps falling so i need to like fix that it drives me crazy 
but I did try to get uh, it up as much as I possibly could, but I'm gonna have to work on it again. Um, but I did uh, clean this out. This is one of those jars. I cleaned that out and fixed it because it was broke. It was just one that was actually really broken. And we had it outside for like the longest time, brought it in, cleaned it up, glued this back together. And then I just added my Valentine's rolling pins to it. These I got at Target like a couple years ago. And then just added my little heart in there for Valentine's. And then these ones I just have right here. I just moved all this stuff around, cleaned off the entire counter, you know, sprayed it down, moved everything around, put my uh, cups over here, my dusting stuff, my counter cleaner right there. So I moved that stuff there. And yeah, it's pretty much what I did this weekend is just kind of clean stuff up, get stuff put away and kind of get some stuff organized. Brian took some stuff down in there on the front porch. So yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and get some stuff cleaned up and I will check back in with you guys a little bit later. So I cleaned up this area over here and worked on my three-tiered tray for Valentine's. So this is kind of what it's gonna look like. I'm sure I'll add some more stuff to it, take some stuff away, but um, for the most part, this is what I have in it. Um, I just kind of put these little these are like little felt hearts. I just kind of put those inside of there. You really can't see them, but it did try to, that one keeps falling, um, tried to keep some of those up here. This is that new little fake plant that I bought. This is that little new mason jar. And then I have another little heart there, that cute little um, succulent that I put there, and then the one down here, and then that new little mason jar. But for the most part, this is what this looks like. Um, again, I might change things around, mix things up a little bit, but for now, that's what it's going to stay like. This is my candle. I need to light that. And then that, um, I just kind of tweaked that a little bit more, took down that third little jar and just left the two up here. And so this is what that's going to look like for a little while. And uh, yeah, so the next thing I need to do is go work on my dining room table, but I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. I hope that you guys enjoyed hanging out with me a little bit today. If you did, give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys next time in Wonderland. Bye guys!